Hello everyone, welcome to the Ichimoku.co Market Minute for the trading day ending Monday, October 17th. To the S&P 500 today on the daily charts and uh, here we see a change of trend confirmed today. Current candle forming a lower high and a lower low. And this is the second consecutive day with a uh, black body candle suggesting uh, some fairly strong negative momentum. Uh, the uh, uh, sellers have closed with control by closing down towards the low and they've shown some commitment by uh, closing down around that level as well. Importantly resistance coming in off this 2134 level, previous resistance a couple of days ago and prior to that support. So we can see how that area has now changed character. There is an opportunity here for the market to trade down to lower levels but we do have strong support extending down to this previous swing low around the 2114 level and for the next day's trading the bottom of the Ichimoku cloud actually moves just slightly higher up to around this 2119 area. So the uh, support could come in uh, uh, quite strongly above that 2114 level at 2119. And just uh, recalling, uh, previously we were looking at this uh, retracement of the previous first time frame downtrend and uh, the market had rallied on a very weak candle. The sellers had taken control off the back of resistance coming in at the 61.8% level and around the Tankerton indicator and above the Kijinsen indicator and the rejection from there was quite strong. We have seen confirmation of that change of trend here today uh, whereas our previous candle was in an uptrend today confirmed downtrend with the market forming a lower high and a lower low. Just looking at the bands here and the market continues to trade down below the lower band. Uh, for the previous day we rallied to the upper band and were rejected as we had done a couple of days ago. With the market continuing to trade below the lower band, it suggests that we have a uh, fairly, fairly strong, um, strongly negative market in the medium term time frame. Although we do want to see the market take out this swing low down around this 2119 level. We did extend down through there to this uh, low around the 2114 area, but that's going to be our benchmark. Strong bearish activity down through there could see the market testing lower. <laughs>